have some more of that Batman material. And I think I can make one of these. I hope. So what we're going to do right here is we're going to take some measurements. And try to write them down and cut them out. See if we can't make Poochie a Poochie sweater. This right here, we're going to say, is 6 inches on the bottom. We have the arm here, A-R-M, and it is 6 inches. Alright. Then we have it down this way, which is 8 and a half inches. So we're going to go 8 and a half inches. Oh, eight and one eight. No. We need a half there. <laughs> Alrighty. So now we want to go around this way with it. Let's see what we can do about going around it. And getting us a measurement. Around this way. Which would be 13 here. So I'm going to put back it's 13 inches. And then we have 11 and a half. Now, she said that she wanted it longer than this. So, if we get it to here, then we could put a ruffle or something on the back of it for her. So, what we got up here? And this right here be the neck. And that's looks like two inches. So now we got all of our measurements. So let's get our stuff out here and let's get busy and let's see if we can make one of these pretty little things for that dog. Alrighty, we got this right here. And yep, this is the way I want. So we're going to start off this way, get this lined up, and we're, where did I draw that? Okay, 13 is going to be the one we want first. So we're going to go down, <coughs> I'm going to scoop this over a little bit. We're going to even this up down here on the line. There we go. Oh, come on now. I wore that line out. Now we're going to go down 13. I'm going to go on down to 14. Uh, let's see. Let me take a look. See, what I want to do is I want to split these two up. I want to put a button here and a button here, and a button here and a button here. So you see how I'm planning on wanting to do it? And then that way, she can pick two sides, and one, either side she gets to, she can unbutton it. So I think what we ought to do is go two more. So it's 14, 13, 14 and 15. So that we'll have enough to work with there. Now then, I'll set that up there. Now with this one right here, we're only going to want one side of it right now. So, right here we're going to fold it in half. Alright. Let's cut off this salvage and get rid of it. Because we don't need it. And now we want 11 inches. Up, so it's not pulling so hard. It is 11, right? 11 and a half. Okay, so we want that half. 11 and a half. Which is right here. Now, we have, this right here would be the back of it. The Batman back. Okay. So now, let's work on the part that goes right here. Uh, all kinds of fiber filling underneath there. Okay, we got um, eight and a half. So we're going to keep it like this, and we'll work off of this piece here. 
So now we want to go eight and a half. And like I said, I want the button. So we want to go two more. So eight and a half. There's one, there's two, which will be ten and a half. And, well, why this go up to that one? For some reason, this one right here is not cooperating with me. So there we go. Now then. Put that part up there. How far down do we have to have it? It's eight and a half, and we want six this way, like that. So we're gonna fold this down. Da -da 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 -da. And then we're gonna go six right here. Is it, or is it six and a half? Nope, six. We're going to go six and a half, just to give a little bit more up to it. Now, there's those two parts. Now we need the neck. Yeah, I got that one, I got that one. Now we need the neck. So, we don't want the same color for the neck. We want something different. And what was the neck... It was two and a half. Well, we got here. Right here. This one's two, and I think we can just use this strip here and be happy with it. What we got here. Or we can use this one. I think this one would be better. It's already done folded. and looks like it's sewed. So I think we can handle that a whole lot better. We can just cut it down to what she needs around the neck. Which, I think what I'm going to do is not going to put that the neck part on. I'll put it on from here, around this way, and leave it open here. And I'll and make it look kind of like a cape, hopefully. Alrighty. I think we can start with those. So, let me get all this straightened out, and we'll be back. Get rid of her. She, uh, taking over my spot again. Alright, now next thing we want to do is we want to turn this under and make us a hem down this way. And we want to take it to the sewing machine and sew it down. And the, ne and the next thing we want to do after this is we want to sew our neck in. So we're neck on. Okay. So we want to take one side and we'll sew this right here on. But we want to cut off what we don't need. It looks to me like I have it sewed right there to there. So I'm going to sew it right here in the middle. Okay. And I probably ought to turn this this way in like that so that it don't um, unravel at these ends. So, alright, I'm going to sew these down, uh, both sets of them, and then we'll be back to see what else that needs to be done. I hope this turns out. I want it to. I ain't never made one of these before. Alrighty, I got the neck sewed down and I put a seam right down through here to keep it going that direction. Now let's see what we could do about this right here and putting our buttons on. <clears throat> if we look at it, it is sewed all the way across. So what we want to do is I want to go down. Oh, I need to put a... a a hem right here across this first. So, uh, let me do that real quick. Because we got to have one there. And we got to have one at the bottom too. So let's do that. Alrighty. Now we have that. Now what we want to do is we want to put it 
right down in here. I'm going to go right past the uh, collar here. So when it goes around its neck, it's not going completely around its neck like this. It's just only going to be right under, right around to its shoulders. All right, right in here, we want to put a button and a button hole right here. And where's my pencil? Oh no, what's my pencil? Let's get the white one. There it is. Get the white one. We're going to want it right about here and right here. <clears throat> right down in here and right here is where we're going to want our buttonhole. Okay, now we're going to go on the other side and <clears throat> we're going to line this one up. Now, where's my. Okay, from here to here, then right here we're going to have a buttonhole. Uh oh, I lost my. <laughs> oh boy, talk about good luck, huh? I need something else to mark with. So it's that don't want to work. Where's my chalk? Alright. Got my chalk. Guess we'll go with that. Alrighty. Right here. And then we're going to go down here to the top of this one. And we're going to put some another mark. So we want to make this is where we're going to put our buttons at. Uh, where's that one at? Oh boy, I'm going to quit. Alright, so. What we want to do is we want to put the button holes on these two here. And the buttons on this right here. So, I'm going to put button holes on that and then I'll be back. That piece does not fit her. So, we're going to have to measure her right here see here it only goes right to there so we, we got enough room here to put where the button will fit so what I'm going to do is measure her and get it up there yeah you're a good girl yeah she's a good girl alright we're going to want it at least five inches so if we go five and a half inches that's going to give us seam allowance on it you good girl. Yeah. So we're going to go five inches on it. So see, this right here fits her fine. Up in here. Up, she don't grow anymore. And it'll come right off. Good girl. Good girl. There you go. I get you. There you go. girl. Yeah. So here is a piece that I have. And what we're going to do is. Okay, you got it. Make it up. Got it. Thank you. You're very well. All right, we're gonna work down. We're gonna work to five inches. Let's get this right here, here to here. One, two, three, four, five, and we're gonna go two more so that we can put a buttonhole on it. So let's go right here. Cut her down. Go up back over there. Now then, what we're gonna do right here is we're gonna fold this in. And this end. So it's probably better just to do it in a tube like that. So we're going to throw a tube together real quick here. Alright, we'll turn it inside outwards or right side outwards. Whatever color we need it today. See? There we go. Now then, just level it out here. Okay. Then let's fold these, this end in, like that. There we go. Alright. Now we're down to here. Now we want to take this one. And on this side, even though I do have the uh, buttonhole here, we want to take this one right here, 
I'm going to sew it down right here across the buttonhole. I'm going to go back over it so that we got two layers on there. So now we're going to put a buttonhole right here for that to clasp to. So I think that would work. So I'm going to go over this again, sew this over here again so it will be stronger. And I'm put a buttonhole on and then I'll put the other side on and we'll see how it works. Got it on her. And it looks pretty good. Let's get her collar up here. There's her collar. And there it is. And it's not tight at all. See? It's loose on her. Okay. For some reason, here, I got it on the same buttonhole. And it's supposed to be on this button. It's easier if I look at you up here. Man, that makes it a whole lot more looser than all. Yeah it's, uh, it's really good. yeah, it's really loose on her down here at the bottom, which I I think it's fine. Yeah. I think it works out good. I think it looks good on you, Lexi. Yeah, mm, you're a good girl. You're a good girl, Lexi. All right. Yeah, let's take this off of you now. Okay. We'll take it off of you. All right, let's finish it up. Come on now. There we go. Alrighty, so, now then we got it to fit her, which that's good. Now then, that worked out good. I'm happy with it now. Now let's see what we can do about this down here at the bottom. And, let's see. We want it a little bit longer, she said. I think I'm going to go with longer, uh, bigger than that. Let's see what we got here. Uh, that's, they would be in there. Alright, let's go with this right here piece. Okay. So, what we're going to do here, this will, yeah, that'll work. That'll work. That'll give us some gather there and make it longer. So what we're going to do is turn it in half. I'm going to lay it down there. And then I'm going to be back so I can cut that. Alrighty. So now we got this right here in half. So what I want to do is take this and I want to put it, oh, let's see. I want it to go like that. So we want to go this way with it. Uh, no, I don't like that one. So let me see if I can't get the other one. Because I don't like that one. Let's try this now. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Doo. See, I still got my all oh, my marks on it. I want it to go. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Doo -doo -doo. All right. Let's see if we can't level this up first. I don't like the way that's going there. Now we got to level. All right. Now, let's see if we can't put us a curve in there. And I think that, that curve right there will work. So we're going to give it a whack off. Alright. There, you can't. <laughs> it don't want to work. Alright. So, now what I want to do is I want to take and turn this inside out like that. I want to sew all the way around it, leaving an opening at the bottom. Alright, we're going to turn this. And then what we're going to do and we'll find our needles. <laughs> Gotta have our needles. There we go. Pick out our corner right here. There we go. Level it all out. Yep, 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 yep. We want to look as good as we can. Got you wouldn't be in nobody's way, would you? Okay. <laughs> there we 
go. Let's go over here on this side. Get our corner pointed out. And go down. Make sure. There we go. There we go. Now let's fold this down. And now we want to sew all the way around. So we can get our, our hole there covered. So we're going to sew from here all the way around to get our hole covered. We got that done. And we got this. So let's find the end of this right here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find the middle of this. And find the middle of this. Do, 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 do. And put me a pin right there. Slot me a pin right there. And now I'm going to line them up. Get rid of one pin. Put the one in there. I'm going to take this one. And I'm going to go let the seam go past it. Just this seam on this right here one. Go past right there and let this thing go past right here. Alright. <laughs> now then, what I want to do from here <coughs> is I want all these to go that direction and all these to go that direction. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down. Let me get my small of these here. Uh, that sand on the back of it wants to hold on to it. Alright. Let's turn this around here. And from out here where the seam is, we'll go right here and we'll put a pin right there. And I'm going to come down here. And I'm going to do the same thing right here. Put a pin. Oh, it's going to go in there. <laughs> Alright. Now that we're going to take us about an inch fold. Put it right there where our needle is. Go down. And then we're going to go over about an Oh, let's go... Oh, let's see how much we got left. Let's go over an inch and put us another pin in there. There we go. Then we have a have that going that away right there. So we'll put a pin right here to hold that. All right. So now let's go over here. This is what did I, <laughs> I forgot. That's, that's a half an inch. That's an inch. So we're going to go this way. Go a half an inch into it. Then go an inch over. I probably got enough to put another one right in here. So let's just see what we can do here. Because uh, I'm pretty sure there's another one that could come in here. We could get one more. Let's do a half right here. Let's do a half right here. But that takes that one up and it shouldn't. We should be halfway. They should be. Okay, we got one, two, three, and we got one, two on this side. So that means I got one of them wrong. That's probably that one right there. Let's see. I do believe I was right. Okay. 
have that one to lay it out. Now that didn't feel too good. If I fold that one down on that one, like that. Alright. Got that one. Okay. So I'll take this one, fold it to it right there. There we go. Now then we have another one in here. Mama Cat, you know you're not you're not making this easy for me to get out my stuff over here. Yeah. I think that would be it right there. Yeah. Somewhere something is not right. Alright, I'm gonna redo this and try to do it the same. Do it. Oh, I took my middle out. Damn it. I don't want to do that. Let's put that middle back. Alright. Now uh, let me try this again. I'm going to go. Yeah. I took that one out too. That one don't work. That ain't going to work. Try this again now. We should have even right here in the middle. It should be even. And that shows it is. Okay. So, now then. Let me get this off now in my way so I can have a flat, flat. Oh, come on now, button. Why aren't you coming out? Probably something give me a problem, doesn't it? Now, Mama Cat, you best move. Alright, we got that. I'm going to go an inch from right here at this corner. And I'm going to turn it around this a little. Yeah, like that. Fold it a half an inch. Put me a pin. Alright. Now I'm going to come down here. Right there. And then I'm going to fold it in a half an inch. Now I'm going to pin it. Hopefully I can get it right here. Alright. So. Let's go over an inch. Go in. Come on, come on, come on. Right there. A half an inch. Or an inch, just an inch. Move your butt out of the way, Mama Cat. Now let's go here. We'll go another inch. Put it in a pin. Alright, now we should have two little ones there. We'll fold that one over flat. Pin it. Then we'll fold that one over flat. Now, the way I'm going to sew it, I'm going to sew it this way, then I'm going to come back and I'm going to sew it this way so they'll lay flat. And we'll see how that works. Let's try it on her. <laughs> we'll get the cat out of the way. Come right here. All there right. you go, Miss Lex. <laughs> come on, Lex. Come on, Lex. She said, I'm getting tired of this. <laughs> I know, she's getting tired of it. Come on, pretty girl. Now, let's get this going on here. Let's put that paw right in there, good girl. Now we're going to stick this one right in there. Now I'm going to pick up the thing. We've got, we got to do something about right in here because it will flop around. 
So we got to put a button and a strap in right in here so that it'll hold right there. And I'll, but she said she wanted it longer, and that's longer. So let's see what we can do about here. So let's measure it. And let's okay, put a thing right in here. Oh, goodness, gonna have the. Okay, that's one. And what does that read over there? Uh, eight and a half. Eight and a half. Alrighty. So now we're gonna work on that part. There you go, Lexi. Eight and a half. Got me another piece of material out here. We are going to go eight and a half. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to want seam allowance and also a two more. So then we're going to go right here. And we're going to cut it. Toss yeah. that over to the side. And now we're going to sew it the two way, the same old way we did before. I don't, this is the first time making one of these. And I don't know if I want to try it again or not. It's not turning out <coughs> to fit her. And I think it's because that's, um, that's yarn and this is not yarn. And I think that's the reason why it's not working. So, now let's turn this around. What did I do with that? There it is. All right. I, you know what? I didn't measure. I didn't measure where to put it at. So we're going to gonna need to put another buttonhole on, in it. And I think i got one more button that's the same as that one. So, I didn't measure down where I should put it at. I wonder if I should guesstimate at it. Alright, we're going to take one in, fold it in, and give her a sew down. Do what, Rick? Yeah, my pencil sharpener is not working. That's not kosher at all. Alright. So let's look at this. We're right here. I think right about here would work. Right there. Let's turn this over this way. So what we're going to do is I'm going to guesstimate and go just a little bit on the, up on that. Find where my ones and all are. Right here. Yeah. We'll go about one and a half inches up. There we go. Right there. <laughs> and then we're going to sew that one down. Oh, wait a minute. I'm going to put my, my buttonhole in there first. But that one's going to be more difficult. So I'm going to put that in and I'll be back. It's okay, Lexi. One more time, baby. One more time. <laughs> One more time, baby. Get that foot. Oh, you're wet from being outside. Yeah. And good. That not hit right through there. Oh, my goodness, yeah. Too tight. Now, when I get it the button in there. No, I don't think it's too tight. And I like that. I like that. <coughs> I like that. That looks so good. Look at it. It looks good. It hits her just fine. Hey, it's a pretty girl. Okay, let me take some pictures. Little thing extra that I did is I put a big buttonhole right here so that when she's got it on, her collar can go right up in here and you can, you know, have her, her uh, lead on it. So. I think that right there is a good thing too. Alright, see you on the next tutorial. Okay.